Hello from the Catalan capital and one of the world's great cities, Barcelona. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. And we're ready for the Champions League round of 16 second leg. How's it going to go, Stuart? Well, Derek, it's all to play for here. This is going to be a really fascinating second leg. But I've just got a feeling that Barcelona will play well tonight and make the most of their slender lead. The starting 11 for Barcelona. Marc Andre Ter Stegen in goal. Sergi Roberto plays with Jordi Alba in the fullback positions. Frankie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. Champions League round of 16, second leg is underway. Pedri. Now with De Jong. Ronald Araujo. Pedri. Jules Kunde on the ball. Frankie De Jong. Pedri. Well, they keep passing away. Araujo. Now with De Jong. Not a pass that lacks quality. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. And now Zielinski. Tostegan was always going to make that save. Unable to keep the ball that time. Ball's gone. Lewandowski. Unable to trouble the defence with that cross. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. Well, he's won the ball. Zielinski. Now can they make something happen? Big chance to get them on terms. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Corner kick played in. Well, it has come to nothing. Politano. And Rachmani has it. Sergio Busquets. Now Jordi Alba. Pedri. Ansu Fati. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Full credit, wonderful stop. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Any goalkeeper would accept corner kick deliveries like that every day. Kim. Ongisa. And now Zielinski. 
André Franck Zombo Onguisa. Well, the first 45 minutes. So the Champions League round of 16, second leg. The second half is underway. An effective challenge. De Jong. Simeone racing forward, trying to catch them out. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. De Jong. And Barcelona showing good width here. And an astute piece of defending. Lobotka. So a half an hour remaining. Promising move from Barcelona. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Amir Rahmani. Stanislav Lobotka. Di Lorenzo. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Barcelona, free kick. It'll be here. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Araujo. Here's Rafinha. Oh, the threat is there. Lewandowski, and it might be, and a goal, it's a two-goal cushion in the tie, and now we can say they're firmly in control of this. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal, just watch his technique here, he just hits through the back of the ball with such power, there's no stopping that. to check on the aggregate score it is 2-0 Zielinski showing good defensive judgment Lewandowski Ten minutes to go. Simeone. Now with Zielinski. Oh, he wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal. Keeper has it now. Zielinski. What a crucial intervention inside the box. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. There will be one minute added on at the end. Sergio Busquets. And that's it, the final whistle, and the hosts will go through. Well, over the two games, they played some really good football. Their passing had purpose, they had players who could run with the ball, and most importantly, their work rate was excellent. A spectacular contribution from Frankie de Jong, eye-catching stuff all round. Stuart, what did you make of his performance? 